Hello, nutrition during and post-COVID is extremely vital because more and more people now are into mild to moderate level of symptoms that do not require hospitalization. So if you are in isolation and at home, you need to remember the first fact that you have picked up infection because you are both malnourished and immunocompromised. There are two things that you need to look at when you're looking at nutrition support. One is the nutrients themselves per se, and the second is the foods that will meet your requirements of the nutrients. Let's look at the nutrients as such. Carbohydrates, you need to curtail them for the simple reason that is where you have to control in terms of your oxygen intake. The more carbohydrate you take, the more oxygen is required. And so you need to cut down on your carbohydrate. Fat, when it comes to fat, yes, it is supportive, but you need to take more of it coming from medium chain triglycerides, for example, through coconut oil or rice bran oil. Proteins, you need to consume much more of proteins because the infection itself is damaging your tissues and you need to repair the tissue. Nutrition guidelines during COVID and post COVID, the emphasis is on the fact that you are both malnourished and immunocompromised to have picked up the infection in the first place. And to prevent further deterioration, you will have to support your system with balanced meal and enough of hydration. When I look at the meal part of it, there are two aspects, the nutrients as well as the food as such per se. If I'm looking at nutrients, the important one is protein. I need lots of it to repair the damage and also for the making of new tissues. And to support further, I need vitamin C and zinc. I get this by taking a lot of dals, the green gram, red gram, black gram, tur dal, masul dal, chanar, chola, rajma, by adding lime, adding it to water also, and drinking it more frequently, and eating fruits, especially bananas. This is very, very vital. We also need to remember, we need to look at nutrition in terms of the symptoms you have. If you have what fever, you need to eat almost 13% more if it is rise of 1 degree centigrade, 6% more energy if it is 1 degree Fahrenheit. If you have diarrhea, you need to see that you maintain your electrolyte balance and hydration. And if you have lost of taste and smell, this is where zinc comes in. So please remember, you need to eat a balanced meal in a solid way. If you're not, please consider re meal replacement, but see to it that you are eating well during your COVID such that you continue on the same thing post COVID and recover faster. If you are eating well, you will recover much faster because recovery depending on the severity of the symptom could range from anything between one week to six months. So wish you good health. Take care. Thank you.